Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a review on this little eBay head unit that I bought. Um, ran me $21 shipped. It's got the, it says it's a little Bluetooth radio. It's actually not that bad. Um, yeah, it comes with this little wiring harness. Has aux out for your sub. And... Well, yeah, I'll just turn it on, show you working on it. I have a USB drive in it, loads, preloads that since first thing in there. It's got a pretty clear screen on it. Super easy to see during the day. I mean, it's pretty bright in here. That window open. Um, tells you the title. Tells you the artist, the the album if it knows it, and the folder name, which is kind of weird, but that's fine. Uh, if you click through your options, you've got volume, bass, treble, balance, fade, and it's loud mode, which basically just gives it more bass. It's preset EQs, which I don't like very much, but the volume's not very loud. It works pretty good. I've got it hooked up to these infinities. They're pretty good 6x9s. Retail at $220. They better be, but this gets pretty loud. Uh, but that's USB drive. Aux in, I have hooked up to my TV, so we can't really test that. Um, I don't know what's going on with the focus. Bluetooth. Oh, I'll connect my computer over here. Let's see. It's a little thing called CarBT. Try to remove it and remember it again. This always takes a little bit longer on my computer. Connecting my phone pretty quickly. There we go, maybe. Yeah. Um, so that's connected Bluetooth. See that right there. It's got a pretty clear Bluetooth sound too. Um, it's got a little slot down here for an SD card. Put some light on it, so maybe you can see it. Right up under there. Um, I haven't tested it. All I've tested is the Bluetooth, USB, aux cord. Um, oh, that's another thing that I need to get. It's got, it's got this little remote that it comes with. And the remote is, not printed very well. I was kind of disappointed in that. Of all things to be bad on this. I guess that's okay though. Um, it works pretty alright. Let me turn my lamp back off. This next button. Um, mute. Pretty quick to respond. Um, you can shuffle through your modes pretty quickly too, unless it's on the radio, which I don't have a radio antenna, so I can't really show that. But you got your USB takes a little bit when it's trying to load too, but you can shuffle through everything pretty quickly. Otherwise, 
Um, but yeah, that's my little review. It's definitely not a bad little radio if you're looking for something cheap and usable. Um, I've been running this thing every day for about... Um, I'd say about three weeks. Haven't had any problems with it. It doesn't overheat. It doesn't have a great heat sink on it. Uh, the instructions are pretty useless, but if you know anything about radios, you'll be fine. Everything's labeled on the top. But yeah, there you go. Um, if you want, you can leave a comment, message me, anything. I can give you a link to where I bought it. But it's $22 new, Bluetooth, shipped on eBay. And I really don't have any complaints with it. So, hope you enjoyed.